Hey guys, welcome to Albay Homestead. Today we will discuss about Persian cats. Uh, Persian cats are one of the most famous breed of feline or uh, the cat family. So if you want to acquire cat, you have to prepare for at least 16 years of commitment. Uh, that's the lifespan of our cats. So uh, based on our experience, you have to consider uh, five factors for raising cats. Number one is your uh, financial capacity. Number two is the health of your cat. Number three is the feeds. And for number four is your place. And of course, for number five is the, life, uh, the lifestyle of your family. Um, no, for number one, uh, for the financial capacity, the cost of a, a feline or a Persian cat is around 10000 to 20000 It depends on the breeder. Uh, you can find lower cost for a crossbreed or uh, without the paper uh, breed, breed without paper. So that's lower cost on the market. For number two is health and the vaccination program for the cats. So you have to uh, prepare for a feline vaccination program. You can consult from a veterinarian on the feline vaccine. So basically a dose of a feline vaccine is around uh, uh, 700 or 800 depending on the brand. For the number three consideration, the feeds and the feeding program for the cats. Uh, the cost of the feeds is around 90 to 120 per kilo depending on the brand of the cat food. And uh, for us, we have 12 cats who are consuming at least uh, 5 to 8 kilos per week. Uh, that's 3 times feeding uh, in the morning, in the afternoon, and at night. So... 8 kilos is our weekly consumption for our 12 uh, cats. And for number 4 consideration is your place or your house where you gonna raise the cats. So basically cat does not require a big space but they require a small private space where they can do their daily activities and they can play around. Uh, it really depends on you uh, but uh, for an initial, if you have a small space, you can consider a small numbers. Or if you have a big uh, area, you can consider also big numbers of uh, cat. It really depends on the, your space. And uh, as a reminder, you have to teach your cat how to use a litter box, especially if you are using, uh, if you are on a small space, you have to teach your cat how to use the litter box because that's one problem if you will not train the cat use that uh basically maamo yung ano yung poops ng cat so uh you have you really have to teach your cat how to use the litter box uh we'll teach you on that on our next video on how to teach your cat to use the litter box so just so, so subscribe and like to our channel so that we can teach you how to use the litter box for the cats and for our last consideration is your family lifestyle. Uh, sometimes you have to be very uh, familiar with the characteristics of the cats. Uh, cats are very clingy friends. Uh, they are clingy pets so they will follow you wherever you go. And of course, they will create noises, meows at your, at your house. So at least your family members should uh, accept that kind of character of cats at home so that's it at least the family members are aware of that and of course the lifestyle should be much on that uh, uh, consideration so i think that's it for our all our videos for today so next time please subscribe to our channel so that we can teach you to teach your cat how to use the litter box so that's it. Uh, thank you guys. Please subscribe and like to our channel. Thank you.